Um, okay, we're going to talk about marketing in this section. How did you go about getting your very first clients? Very first clients were actually me talking directly to a GP and suggesting that I provide psychological therapy at their GP practice. We've had some lovely leaflets developed. Um, I decided that I wanted them not to be on just sheets of photocopy paper folded up, but proper cards that people can take away that mimic the look and feel of our website. So I chose um, a designer who could really work with me to produce what I wanted. Also, um, I began work for an agency who referred work to me. Um, and I also began to speak to my ex-colleagues from the NHS and let them know. So it was a bit of networking, really. I suppose I hadn't really thought about it as that mm. at the time. Mm. Word of mouth is extremely mm. important to us. Um, having repeat business through um, clients recommending us to other people who come through. Mm. Um, another would be that we have direct relationships with some referrers which I've built up over time. Mm. So particular psychiatrists, particular solicitors, particular agencies. Another thing that I developed um, at one point was business cards and gradually, gradually, at first I felt very awkward handing them out mm. and now I don't go anywhere without my business cards. Mm. How did you go about setting up your website? Ah, now the first website we had um, we set up a website um, with working with somebody who was a friend of a family. First website, I was very, very pleased with. I love the look and feel of it. That was really nice. And I learned a lot from it. But then I wanted it to be a place where people could go and they would find a resource where they would actually get, get information. They might want to download some of the information that it wouldn't be just a place that they would come and then come through and make an inquiry with mm. us, but that they might actually take away a piece of material from it, that they print something off, and our name and logo would be on that. Did you register your website on various online directories, things like that? Yes, I've registered my website on um, as many of the professional directories as I can, um, because obviously I'm paying for my own um, professional standing. Um, so I make sure that my website address is there. Mm. Um, then there are other directories which are free. Mm -hmm. um, if they're free, I get my website uh, address on there and some details about me so that people are likely to click through um, about me and about the service we offer. Um, another thing that I discovered, which was very simple, was that if I made sure that I was on Google Maps, mm. then bingo, then I went, I could see that that affected the way I was being found when people did local searches. Mm.